you go down in the woods today, you better go in disguise. Well, it looks to me like the tree I was photographing the other day, a monstrous palm collection of, I don't even know what kind of palm that is, but it's a multiple palm, and it's gotten so overgrown, I think they're going to trim it, so we'll watch. There's been some massive growth here before that's been trimmed back. Look at this, too. That's a date palm, a dactyl, what is it? Dactyl what? Dactylifera. Dactylifera. So they're not going to cut it down. I thought they were going to cut it down. They're just going to trim out the dead fronds. So it's going to be quite a job. They're going to start in a minute. So when they move their car out, they're going to start trimming this. Well, just met the owner and he said this tree got diseased, but they managed to save a little tiny bit up there. So look at that. Still growing even though that's dead and it's kind of like a tree sculpture now, isn't it? This whole house was built in the 20s and that's the owner, Lynn. And uh, I thought they were cutting it down, but he's not. He knows better. And he also says it's full of rats. I asked if there were pigeons, he said no rats. And he's looking for some volunteer rat catchers. So isn't that great? Here it comes. We'll do a time lapse uh, slideshow too. And they're going to show me exactly what's happening here. That's basically what we're going to do. We're going to uh, remove only the dead trunks. Oh, you yeah. See, now you're able to see the trunk over there. Oh, I like that too. So, that one over there still has uh, the dead trunks. We're going to remove those later on. But if this is basically what you're going to do, then you see the only on dead trunks. Yeah. Basically, it's cleanup. Cool. We don't want to take too much out because uh, uh, it's not very good for the tree. What about the, uh, the ratones in there? Well, we can do much about it. So you can you see them, or do they run away when you come? Well, they run away, but uh, <laughs> like, they come back later to the same. Oh, I got day. you. Yeah. So once we went out of the, the tree, they they come, they come back, back again. <laughs> so you they can, you can slip. Did you see it's about four or five uh, tall uh, they, I mean palms over there together. So they yeah they walk through the ah uh, oh, like forest. a canopy, huh? Yeah. So when, oh. we done, we, when we done with one palm, they come back to the palm. Wow. Again, so they know how to do it. <laughs> they That's know the area very well. Pretty so. clever rats. So yeah. I thought they would run away, but when the trimmers come, they just move across the fr palm fronds to the next palm, and then when they're done, they come back to where you've trimmed. Yeah, because we're not, we're not doing separation between one palm and another. Ah, I see. The top front is still, is still so attached. Like a canopy up the there, yeah. yeah. So there's still a little floor that they can run across. Oh, yeah, yeah. And rats are pretty clever, you know. Yeah. They, can, they do everything. But look at that. Anyway, so we'll be back. What's your name? Mario. Mario, and he works for Atlas Tree Service. So there you are. It takes a lot of men, doesn't it? Well, we need to be careful because there's a lot of, a lot of traffic yeah. here, a lot of cars, a lot of uh, people uh, yeah. running, uh, walking. So, so you we have need to be careful. We don't want to yeah. cause any danger. Yeah. Danger. So just one guy working up there. Well, for now, yeah. Yeah. And this situation, uh, because we need to be careful with the, with the surrounding areas. Gotcha. So. Yeah, that's another thing you have to look out for is flying pedestrians. Safety first. Safety first. Good. All right. For the crew and for the for the, for the pedestrians. For the yeah. Day, yeah. Almost to the down. Almost that far down? Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, someone else will be like four houses down. Yeah. What was this one? Yeah. What have you heard about the speckles? I just everyone thinks that people have they, they told me. You know, it. nothing. Uh, nothing. I don't know if it's factual or not. You know. Yeah. Well. You know, at the end of it, uh, it'll be like Casey Anthony. You know. Ah, we don't OJ, know. OJ Simpson. Yeah, well, you know, heavy. If there's any logic to any reasoning to anything, forget it. Lynn Dugan. This is Lynn Dugan, and he's had his tree done. But the rats are still there, right, Lynn? But well, we got to live with it. Yeah. All right, man. Yeah, well, we don't know how to get rats. I'll tell you one way to, to get rid of the rats get rid of the United States Navy. 
the Navy the it, introduces the rats into this do, island. They do, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> so I'll blame the Navy. <laughs> Put that in your That's party. very brave. <laughs>